This is the big day. The biggest day in world football. The World Cup final, it only comes around once every four years. And the prize is to be the top country in the world game. It's a brilliant setting, the Luzhniki Stadium in Moscow. And we're lucky to be here. We being myself, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Yeah, we certainly are lucky. If you think back to previous finals, they've not all been absolute entertainment, but I think this one will, given the two sets of strikers on show. I've got to say, I think there'll be goals out there. And now it's time for the national anthems. And this is the team news for Spain today. David De Gea starts in goal. Sergio Ramos plays with Gerard Piquet in central defence. Thiago plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. Diego Costa is the lone striker today. Thank you. In the world is watching. The 21st World Cup final is underway in Moscow. Well, this is a mouth-watering prospect, and I'm sure the players down there feel the same. Trying to switch on. And now the shot! Great work by the goalkeeper. The ball is his, and he's made sure he's protected it. Jordi Alba. And it takes a nick off the player, out for a throw. The referee asserting his authority here early on, giving that free kick. Played away, well away from goal. Kevin De Bruyne. Well, suddenly they could be on the counter-attack. Now, can he take them on? Put in from the wide area. Great header, great save! Oh, nothing wrong with that, was that? I thought he was going to score with a header, but top keeping. Oh, Ray! He scored to put his side in front in the 2018 World Cup final. What a goal! Well, he's laid down a marker, and so has his team. That is a great goal of its type. Perhaps don't see as many as we used to of it, but the cross made the header so possible. Yeah, it is still one of the, the best sights in football, and I think supporters enjoy it. Spectacular header. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Thiago. Jordi Alba. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. Come away with the ball cleanly. Great tackle. Kevin De Bruyne. He's a very popular player. This guy, isn't he? And you can see that they want to give him the ball and get the ball from him. Yeah, they do. I mean, I think he's got friends out on that pitch and uh, players around him that uh, enjoy playing with him. Simple as that. Well, he saw the guy he could switch the play to and came up with the pass as well. Excellent. Harmlessly through to the keeper.
Good defending. Sergio Ramos clears it here. All right. Here's Isco. On the move and able to cut out the pass. Well, now there's a chance to attack from the tackle. Looking for Lionel Messi. Griezmann! He's got to it, and he's claimed the ball too. Well, it is amazing that these two teams have got to the World Cup final. It does show the breadth of talent around the globe. Yeah, it is the beauty of football, isn't it? Sometimes you just cannot predict these two sets of players, having said all that, thoroughly deserve to be where they are. And in it goes. <laughs> Supported there as he can head it on to someone who's waiting to receive it. Jordi Alba. Sergio Busquets. Oh, he's gone for the back heel. Kevin De Bruyne. And it's Ronaldinho again. Moore. Messi. With Griezmann. Well, that looked a decent chance to attack until the player managed to read the pass. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Attacking well here. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Lionel Messi. They've lost the ball and the counter-attack could be there. Isco. Shots on here. Typical brilliance from David De Gea. It's the reflexes, the agility. No doubt that's a corner. De Bruyne's corner. And they get it away. Pogba. Ronaldinho gets his cross in. But it's rather skewed off his head in the end. Yeah, he, uh, he didn't catch it properly. I think he probably closed his eyes there. Carvajal. Silva. Pogba. Ronaldinho. Well, he's got the ball there in the defensive zone by reading the play very well. Iniesta. Here they are, on the attack. It's Isco. Trying to catch the other team out with a quick break here. A couple of teammates who are clearly on the same wavelength. Oh, and Messi, offside here, stopped in his tracks. Ronaldinho, it's De Bruyne, Henri, Iniesta, taking it away and he's got a chance. Difficult decision for the officials here, but it is a throw, not a corner. Kevin De Bruyne, and they've cut it out. Praise for trying the shot, Alan. Well, his teammates aren't too happy. Ronaldinho. There's good progress with this attack. Oh, charge down. Sergio Busquets. Headed down to a teammate. Griezmann. And shoots! Oh, what a fine goal! They lead by two now. They'll feel a little bit more comfortable, and they're good value for this advantage at the moment.
Two for him on the day. And two very well taken goals. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was very well taken. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Three minutes from the referee via the fourth official. That's the decision regarding added time. And now Iniesta. Kevin De Bruyne. And here is Ronaldinho. It's good play until they. Well, that's half time. Well, the second half is underway, the World Cup final. It's a tightish game. Yeah, it has been fairly tight. I'd expect the match to open up a bit more in the next 45 minutes. Really looking forward to it. I think it should be fascinating. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Ori! Well, that needed a more subtle touch. He's gone for power and he's nowhere near. Well, I don't think he kept his head down, actually. Probably thought he'd scored before he'd even hit it. Iniesta played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. PK puts out a foot to good effect. Coming on strong and looking. Now, what is the referee going to do here? It's a tactical substitution for the losing team here. And the wall gets absolutely no trouble for the goalkeeper here. Here's Isco. Now Messi. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. And the ball now with Ronaldinho. Good forward play from them. Here's Thierry Henry. That's going to run on through to the goalkeeper. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. Looking for Isco. Here's a chance to attack. Silva. Carvajal. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Pogba. Kevin De Bruyne. Ronaldinho. Griezmann. De Bruyne. Now with Isco. Cleared away by the defender. Under some pressure, he shielded it well. Silva. Griezmann. Being closed down here, Sergio Busquets. Spain looking set maybe to make a chance now. Got to clear it now. It's messy. Sergio Busquets with the interception. Griezmann. Here's Isco. That's good movement forward here. Iniesta. 
Sergio Busquets. It's Isco. On towards Messi. Could be dangerous. Kevin De Bruyne. And here's the shot. Drew everything behind that shot. And frustrated that it wasn't quite on target. Well, if he keeps getting in those kind of areas, I'm sure he'll score pretty soon. Number 12, Sal. Pogba. Kevin De Bruyne. And now Messi. There's a dangerous feel to this attack. It's looking good from their point of view. Simple save for David De Gea. Quick-witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there. He's go. Good defending. Carvajal. Griezmann. It's De Bruyne. Here's Isco. That's offside Isco. It's gone out of play, and it will be a throw from that to headed clearance. One of the things the managers have to do is keep all their forwards happy. Well, if you're on the bench, you're not so happy. If you get on, you feel a bit better. And it's an incisive pass. Well, a big sigh of relief from the defenders that that breakaway was stopped. They can't keep it on the pitch. It's gone out for a throw. Kevin De Bruyne. Ori. It's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. Spain get the throw. Jordi Alba. Saul. Alvaro Morata. Tight against the touchline. Pretty clear that it was going to end up with a throw in. Saul. Comes in with a tackle. Well, the ref's going to let play go on here. It's an advantage. De Bruyne spotting the through pass. Needs to stay cool now. Ore! It's a goal! It's a typical day's work for Thierry Ore. He's got his third goal. Absolutely fabulous. And the Frenchman has torn the opposition apart. Well, some players might switch off if they've scored a goal, even two goals in the game, but he's greedy for more, in the best way, I mean, and he's got a hat-trick. Yeah, he's been a danger from the start, his work rate, his, his runs off the ball, and been top class. game petering out a little bit now with both sides settling for what's on the scoreline vast difference between the two teams the fourth official is good chunk of added time here three minutes three minutes it's a good attack missed by spain his soul worst gets his soul and now the shot the shots hit the post Final whistle, they are the world champions, a day to remember in Moscow, they've come through the group stage, the round of 16, the quarter-final, the semi-final and now they've seen off serious opposition here today. What a moment, Martin, for all these players out there. A moment they will never forget for the rest of their lives. This is special.
against their names in football history long after they've gone it will say world's champion there's no higher accolade no and it's difficult to argue that they're not deserving winners in this competition to a man they gave it their all out there champions of the world the best feeling in the world they're on top of the world There's a real togetherness amongst those players, and they've needed it at times. They came through some sticky periods in this competition, but it was all worth it, wasn't it? Sharing it with the supporters, and they'll know where their families are as well. Forever linked with Moscow, forever linked with Russia forever linked with the FIFA World Cup. And they needed those fans at times, they've stuck with them. And quite rightly, they acknowledge that support. They will not want this day to end, but they will get some souvenirs of it now as the photographers gather for these prime pictures of the winners of the FIFA World Cup 2018.